That's what's good, but anyway, uh, other than that, hey, <laughs> this old lady looking at me, um, but other than that, you know, I'm just gonna keep it the pushing and the not to be on me. I don't want to think we recording. Alright. Let me show you. Uh -oh. Yeah, it's a, it's a big boo boo. Bad. Yeah, you got to worry about side bumps too. They glued your side bumps down. That's terrible. Um, so if you break the glass, it's gone. You can't even pull the side moldings off the side no. of the window. These are very, they're not really tricky to get off, but you got to be careful. Okay. Um, because at the bottom of these moldings, they, they form like a, almost like a little uh, loop. And on the body, there's two white pins. It's got a little nipple. And the nipple goes <laughs> through that loop, and that's what locks in place. Mm -hmm. Come over here. And I don't know if you ever wondered why this was bulging out like that. I was telling her that it looks like it was yep, nice. bulging out because when you pry it back, if you see that black stuff right there, that's glue. So they urethane oh, it. Um, they, what is wrong? What the? They ruined it. And the other side, like that too. Um, basically, we'll put it back together. We're going to order you new side motors. Now, I can replace the windshield now, but I mean, the motor's going to be too hard. You're not going to put these motors back down without me gluing them back down. I don't want to do that on this car. I'd rather just go ahead and get your side motors ordered. Get side motors. Um, yeah, yeah. They, I see you right there. Do y'all no favors. Because even if you take it off, it's going to be a little glob of glue yeah. they put on. It's going to mess the paint up. Even that second one's got it on there. But you see some little white hooks right there I was telling you about? Yeah. See the little white edge? That's what goes through the loop on these moldings. And uh, like I said, it, it grabs that molding and just locks it. You know, that's mm -hmm. what keeps it down. So they probably just broke it. To me, whoever done it down there is probably inexperienced. Um, this is kind of like the Lexus like IS 250. It's almost the same windshield design. They got the same clip, same molding. They're very fragile. They break if you're not careful with them. Um, really, to me, I think this is a crappy design by Lexus. Um, you should not have moldings this fragile. But from a technician's point of view, too, you gotta be careful. You gotta just go in there and like a fool in the china shop. You know, you gotta make love to the car. Mm -hmm. You know, because we get paid by the job. We mess something up, Comes they take the money from me and give it to the next guy that fixes it. Now, I don't know how that company down there in Florida does. You know, um, I just know that they got something with Safe Life. If they have issues, say like they're in a different area and they don't have that business up there, say so why they take care of the work for them. Yeah, it's like a sister, like a sister-in-law company or something. <coughs> you know, like, like a big insurance company. Yeah. You know, they have a small branches, and that's 
And there's a couple of them like that that we deal with. So, no, but like I said, we, we'll get you those moldings. Because really, I have air coming through. Air coming through it. Oh, I don't doubt it. And I, I can't, can, I mean, if I go over 45, I have air coming through. So now I'm going back to Florida in the morning, driving on the highway. Yep. You know, I'm not going to go 45. Yeah. You know, that's illegal. So how can um, I? Are you hearing it from the bottom or the top, or kind of like top. all over? Top. Yeah, it, it's coming from. The, I mean, I can almost tell by the just the installation. I mean, I wouldn't doubt there's an air noise. Um, I don't like to bash anybody, but you know, this looks like a rookie job. It was a BS yeah, that's job. My I've been doing it ten years. I've seen a lot, and I've done some rookie jobs back when I started. Mm -hmm. You know, I was always kind of like I missed something up. Crap, man! I don't want to tell nobody. Don't worry about getting fired. Yeah. But then when you get to the point of You gotta own up to it. Yeah. Safe place pays for everything. Yeah. Safe place not gonna fire you because you miss it, you break the mold. It happens, you know. So I learned to be honest with the customers. Everything. They might be a little upset, but yeah. they want to get handled. Yeah, I would have rather them did that then <clears throat> versus <laughs> the one field in saying, you know, you're good. I'll be you know. honest with you, it took some balls. Excuse my language, it took some balls to do that. Across the top of that uh, that paint like that with that primer. Man. <laughs> you were right. He was brave. He was brave, but I'll be honest with you, most <clears throat> people that own Lexus, BMWs, Mercedes, um, they look at their home. Yeah. You know, it's not like somebody bringing up you know, uh, 1992 Ford F-150, mm -hmm. paint chips, um, they still <coughs> shit. I don't care. You put it in. I don't right. care what the rest of it looks like. But I deal with a lot. We deal with a lot of high-end cars. And, uh, Everybody make sure. I know these customers. People know what their car look. They know what their car looks like. <laughs> they the cash. Look. They know what their car look like. Yeah, you know, some people spend a lot of money on these cars. You know, and they take a lot of pride in it. And they want it to look like a different factory. All right, let me uh get ready in there. Give him the order some side notice. Do it right, do it light, do it wrong, do it long. I mean, but yeah, I'd rather have it done right. Absolutely. Yeah. So, thank you. For yeah, thank you, sir. Hey. I have to pray a little bit harder when you make this trip. That's all that is. You'll be all right. It just sucks that they did what they did. Now this is when you really. Hey y'all. As you can see, um, I did not get my windshield replaced as I thought that I would. Um. It was more of a botch job than we thought. So now they're gonna have to order more pieces um, for my windshield. Um, the side moldings that come standard that you can take off any windshield and put it back on, um, that you don't need to buy for every single windshield. Um, Found. But you don't need to buy for every windshield. You can use the originals. The fools broke it and then decided to glue, glue it. Then <laughs> decided to glue it on. So they can no longer be used. So instead of me riding ugly without the side pieces. I chose to wait and not go outside. If you want to know what I'm doing right now, I'm trying to wash clothes. As usual. Because now I can't get it replaced until it comes in. And of course, it's Christmas season. And I'm not going to get it replaced until January.
Let's keep it too late. It's early really in the morning. I'm just going to be packing. I'm just going to be packing and washing clothes. And that is about it, y'all. So, I will probably talk to you guys when I got some action going on. So, bye, y'all.